In a house in the woods not far away, there lives a different kind of cute. These five peach fuzz critters are Cornish Rex kittens, born just four days ago. The Cornish Rex was a breed developed by accident, resulting from a mutation in Cornwall, England in the 1950s. Their coat is extremely fine, like down. They lack the outer hair layers of other cats. As a result, they're said to have the softest of all cat coats. Cornish Rex come in all colors and patterns. Mom Beanie is all white, while Dad Linus has a red tabby coat. The breed is known for being athletic and playful like a dog and they use their paws like skillful hands. And Linus loves to clown around. Just because he's a dad, it doesn't mean he'll stop playing like a kitten. Though these five Cornish Rex, four girls and one boy, can't do much yet, one day they'll have to keep up with the liveliest dad on the block. White-coated Tofu sets off away from the gang of four girls. The only boy already feels the need to prove himself and get to the front of the dinner line. Then when his sisters make it to the meal, he's not too concerned about chivalry. And when Tofu's had his fill, he puts himself at the head of the table. His red tabby sister Kiki is dining unconventionally. coat color is just like her dad Linus, and it looks like she's also inherited his love for acrobatics. Dad Linus can't wait for the day when these kittens can be his playmates. Back at the Cornish Rex house, the kittens are now three weeks old and looking even more unusual. Their eyes have now opened, and their vocal cords seem to have loosened up. Which comes in extra handy for only boy Tofu, who's got four sisters to speak over. Mom Beanie is taking a break from all the commotion alongside a sunbathing companion. This is Donna the Iguana. It seems being short of hair is the norm in this unusual household. Beanie gives her lizardy housemate an invitation to play. But it seems Donna's not much of a party animal. As she makes her escape through the living room, Donna notices the new arrivals. And they notice her. Red Tabby Kiki tries to warm up her new cold-blooded friend. But Donna's not in the mood to cuddle. With all the kittens causing a fuss, someone pops in to see what all the noise is for. 
In this full household, there's a new face around every corner. And this one belongs to Timber the German Shepherd, who's got lots of love to give. So Mom Beanie tries him out as a babysitter. Timber's intentions may be good, but to a small kitten, a nanny this big poses a few hazards. But the kittens warm quickly to Timber's thick, snuggly fur. When you haven't got much of it yourself, you'll get it where you can. Tofu is glad to have a guy around to even out the numbers. And he gets some male bonding time all of his own. Back at the Cornish Rex house, the kittens are five weeks old and stretching their long legs. As the only boy, Snowy Tofu feels the need to show his four sisters he can stretch the furthest. Mom Beanie and Dad Linus are just big kids at heart. They've been looking forward to the day their kittens were big enough to join in their fun. Kiki is Dad's little look-alike and his biggest fan. And she's eager to take in all his tricks. Even when he plays rough. And Kiki's siblings follow her boldness and start to clown around, too. After the play session, the kittens curl up under the supervision of babysitter Timber. But only boy Tofu doesn't seem to be tired and is giving the sitter some attitude. So gentle giant Timber gives Tofu a loving reminder of who's in charge. And this nanny soon figures out how to get even the feistiest kitten to sleep. <laughs>